I was named principal of Canterbury School uh, in approximately December of the year before it was opened. And the reason that was, uh, was done was that I was to, to recruit and, and work with the staff that was going into the new building. The district did not give me the rest of the year off to do that, so I had two jobs. I was principal of West School and principal of Canterbury School for, for a year and a half. Uh, at the same time, Bob Blazer, who was a master at writing grants for money, wrote a Title III grant that proposed to invite teachers from all over McHenry County to come and spend two weeks with us at Canterbury learning about working in open spaces with team teaching and individualized instruction and that type of thing. We did not know we were getting the grant until summertime was almost upon us. I, and we had not told the teachers anything about this. So one day, surprise, guess what? You're going to have guests there. <laughs> For the next three years, you're going to be working with guests in your room all the time. But it turned out to be a very great experience. And a wonderful, wonderful lady named Margaret Neenstead was a director of that program. The, the, the people came and spent two weeks with us. Uh, they worked right in the classroom with, with the teachers. The title program also provided an aid for each, each area. And so we had a lot of people working in the, in the building. We were able, through the grant money, to have a workshop for the teachers in the summertime to prepare for this. The grant paid for substitutes. We had permanent substitutes on our staff that went to the schools and spent two weeks substituting for the teachers who were with us. We had a lot of people working in the building and we were able to develop quite a good team teaching individualized instruction program.